Hey everybody, Shan TV here. Hope you're having a fine day, fine evening. I'm doing just fine myself. And we're back with some Sid Meier's Civilization 6. Got Jimmy Rags in the background. He's doing some personal stuff. Um, so he'll be muted for this one, but he is playing. Uh, you look up here, he's got his name up there. Uh, anyway. So yeah, let's just jump right into it. This will be episode four, and I hope you guys are enjoying. Uh, if you do like it, hit that like button, hit that subscribe. It's free, it don't cost anything, and it's motivation for me. So, it needs orders, let's go. Uh, okay, time to attack, I guess. Hopefully I don't get stopped here. But it's high time that this barbarian can't get out of town. For sure. Can we do anything here? No, it looks like that's gonna be it for the moment. I'm gonna just leave him on the land that we own. And that's all we got. I am at three, six, eight cities we are turn 108 right now out of uh, 250 I didn't realize I put a cap on it but I guess we'll do what we do let's do what do we think combat strength versus land units combat strength when defending probably the defending huh Let's do that. Because <clears throat> Germany's going to try and come over here at some point and wreck my face. Let's take this barbarian camp on. And that's a victory. Absolutely. Get some gold out of that. Finish off this caravel over here. Promotion available. That's what I like to see. I'm going to have the horsemen move up there. And just start moving units up one by one. See if we can get these bowmen to finish off the man at arms. Yeah. Not a bad start to the episode, if I do say so myself. Um, do we want the plantation right away or probably the lumber mill? I'm thinking it's going to be Lumber Mill. Yeah, we want productivity. <clears throat> this guy's going to have to wait. We got the commercial hub. So, the aqueduct has to be right next to the city, and... I don't really want to take up much, but I don't have to. We'll put it right here. Remove the woods on this tile, that's fine. <coughs> Got our builder here, I'm going to send him out to make a fishery. Uh, I did not see where the... There he is. The caravel went that was over here. We want to keep him away from our island city. He's going to do nothing but cause trouble. Get that fishery built. And I'm just going to have this builder keep skipping until this rice field is ready. And that's my turn. I want to be able to talk during these videos. <coughs> Excuse me. But I don't want to annoy Jimmy with the whole streaming, um, recording, talk. Let's see, what do we got? Choose production. <coughs> do a monument and get some culture.
I'm thinking that an aqueduct is out of the question here. We can work on something like Colossus or Mausoleum. Must be built adjacent to Harbor District, which is right here, which makes that out of the, out of the question. So I can do the Colossus and then I can use my great uh, whatever he is. Wherever he is? He's right here, the engineer. It's going to give me additional trade route capacity, grants a trader unit, going to give me gold, admiral points per turn. Yeah, I think I'm just going to go ahead and, oh no. Never mind, I'm not going to do that because that fishery is like super important to me. We'll save the engineer for something else. Uh, let's go with, what do you have over here? Catapult? And I'm assuming that can be upgraded. It can be upgraded. But it's gotta be in a friendly city or friendly territory. So if I bring him, let's see, bring this guy here. And promote him. He's gonna want combat strength versus uh, naval units. Uh, man, I really need to upgrade this catapult. Friendly territory. Does that mean that I can upgrade him in the Vatican? I wonder. There's another one right here. You know, I'm just going to leave them to do their thing. And this probably isn't going to work out well because of this fortification here. But I'm going to try. Let's choose. Oh, so what do we want to do? Pillage road or pillage pillage? I think I'm going to pillage. Bring him up. Bring him up. <clears throat> and he actually has another action. So. I mean, I can just keep pillaging. Let's fortify him right there, actually. Uh, let's see. We got this extra caravel that we built. So I'm going to send him straight out in a way to block off the barbarians so that if I do decide to pull out these catapults and upgrade them to the trebuchets that that can be done safely. This builder... This builder... They want a sawmill right here. And does it only show like wanted upgrades? Like in the vicinity of where they are, that must be the case. Uh, I kind of mm, sawmill would be really good there. Okay, I'm sold. Let's build a sawmill. So they built the fishing thing here. What is that called? Fishing boats. They built the fishing boats there. So let's go get some moo cows. <clears throat> Uh, and I don't know if I destroyed that carvel that was over here, so let's do some movement action. I'm not seeing it. I'm gonna go back. I'm just gonna keep this carvel close to that city. Now, there's gotta be a barbarian camp down here somewhere. Because I keep getting all kinds of barbarian units coming up from the south. Um, let's see, so production for our main city. I think I need to stop building units because it's severely hampering the amount of gold I'm getting, so let's go for the monument. Some more production down here. <coughs> Library's gonna cost me 
Commercial hub's already maxed out down here. You know what? Library it is. Choose production over here. The commercial hub would be nice, but 28 is a lot of turns. 12 is actually a lot of turns, too. I need... I need some more production and population down here, though, so... Uh, I think maybe I'll get that mine going right here straight away. That'll give me some production. And next turn. Frederick Barbosa has proposed another deal. I hope it's better than the 150 gold that he was trying to give me before. Doing the sawmill here. Uh, we're doing a sawmill here. This is my Carvel. And I'm gonna park him right on the fish and put him to sleep that way. Or we'll put him alert. That way nobody tries to come and pillage my fishing boats. Get the moo cows going. Go ahead and rest and repair this. And I'm gonna bring this Carvel in for the attack over here. Uh, whatever this trebuchet's on can't be pillaged. So let's just do some attacking on the main city here. Archers up. Oh, sorry, the crossbowmen. And I'm gonna pillage the road now. And have him fortify. She's some production at the main city. No aqueduct. So the ancient walls provide tourism later. No units. District based project which provides a large amount of gold every turn and great merchant points once finished. District based project which provides gold every turn and great engineer and gold every turn and great admiral. Hmm. Just do the ancient walls. It's only two turns. And we'll see what Bobosa's proposal is. Oh, you just want peace now. You don't want to give me any gold. All you have is the 125. No, sorry dude. That's that's not gonna work. I I will not give you what you want. Absolutely not. Friendship expired. Your friendship with Jimmy Rags has run its course and will have to be renewed. I've found a village inhabited by people. Okay, so we built the sawmill here. Um, and so this builder is just going to kind of sleep right here. And this guy can do the plantation. And this guy, what have we got out here? What is this, stone? We got more fish here, do I wanna buy? Six turns until growth. I think I'm gonna buy, let's buy. Choose civic, we got guilds. Great Merchant Points, Chichen Itza, which has already been built. Yep, 
You know, that's actually really nice. So there's Anger, Anger Guat. Uh, plus one population in all current cities when built. Plus one housing in all cities. Must be built adjacent to Aqueduct District. Which isn't going to happen here. And you get faith from it. I think I'm going to go for guilds. Okay, so this Carvel is all ready. It's time to move him up. This one's just about ready. Uh, and this guy's going to come out here and build another fishery. You've discovered the divine rights. Jimmy Rags wants to be friends again. Uh, so there's a village down here. So as soon as I take care of these man at arms, I can take that village. Finally, I haven't gotten any villages yet so far. New government, <clears throat> monarchy. It's gonna provide me two more cards, 20%. Influence bonus, 50% production towards defensive buildings, plus one housing for each level of wall. Uh, I think we go to Monarchy for now so that we can get the extra cards. We don't have a Holy Site right now, so we're not benefiting from that. Plus two great Admiral points per turn. There's two great scientist points per turn. Um, I think we want... I don't know. What do I want? What do I want? Plus two gold from all trade routes. That might be good. Let's do the culture bonus since we're not really working on culture. That might help us in the long run. Um, unit maintenance reduced by one gold per turn per unit. That is extremely OP for me right now because I've got so many combat units. Uh, and then... I can do the Diplomatic League and that'll really boost the amount of envoys I've got. Well, I mean, it'll boost them all by one. I kind of want to go Great Scientist though. So let's do that. Confirm policies there. Unit needs orders. is going to do it for the moment. Oh, I can attack his knights down here. Well, maybe not. Uh, let's see. Let's alert the pikemen up here and go to next turn. Sorry, Jimmy. That was a lot of stuff. Pikeman, you're going to have to wait. Got a promotion available on my catapult. Yeah, 
Yep, you're gonna wait again, pikeman. And I totally just destroyed his knights. That was awesome. Or did I? No. Nope. I thought I did. No such luck. Let's bring this caravel over now that he's ready to go. Uh, this one's building the plantation. This guy is attacking the pikemen. We can recruit a great merchant. Grants one toys, a uniquely manufactured luxury resource, which provides plus four amenities. Yes, we like toys. So let's bring the toy merchant down to like, what do we think? Maybe over here. Cheese production. I wanted to build a, another settler. I am going town building crazy. Over here we've got Mont Saint Michael. Must be built on floodplains or marsh. That's perfect. So let's do that. And I'll grab this great engineer and bring him down here. And I'm going to use him up on Mont St. Michael, and hopefully that will guarantee me that monument next turn. Fishing boats over here. Next turn. My only combat really is probably going to be down here. Oh no. They actually attacked up here. Look at that. But the Vatican's going after him. Good Vatican. Oh, and then I did get attacked down here. And that hurt, so they're going to have to go back up. At least to there. I don't want them to die. I need them. Uh, okay, so as far as for what's left here, we can do some more production over here. And I guess I'm going to do that. <clears throat> I can promote land units, land units, district defenses. None of this stuff's going to be really good right now, I think. So I'm just going to have him do some straight attacks. Same with the other guy. <clears throat> I'll have the archer attack as well. And let's see how much damage the horses do. Oh, that's not good at all. I'm going to promote the pikemen. Choose some production down here. Let's go ahead and do the monument. Another deal from Bobosa. 
another garbage deal from Babosa. He is spending up his money, that's for sure. I should just ask him for this city and see what he says in exchange for peace. see world rankings do I rank no oh I do domination victory I'm leading military strength 465 where's Jimmy at Jimmy's 111 my military strength is four times his very nice All right, their knights took to the water here. Let's see if the Vatican can take care of that for me. It's looking promising. Very promising, good job Vatican, very good. Let's do some more ranged attack here. at a comfortable place to be able to deal with them. If I attack with the horsemen, it's certain death. But the pikemen looks like a victory, so let's go in. And it's ours. Very nice. Very nice. Good job, guys. Good job. We can upgrade the catapults now and go for their next city. Marvel, we want combat strength versus naval units. Now I can sleep. The horsemen can. Do I want to fortify until healed? I think I want to just get out of the way. Go alert up here. Mumbai will go to Treyer. Probably not saying that right. New trade route capacity. Great person activated. Do I want to keep the city? Yes, I do. Choose research. Gunpowder is complete. Yes, sir. Thank you. Bombard. Ooh, I like bombard. That looks good. Four turns. Let's do that. Choose civic. Can build the chancery. A lot of stuff in there. Reformed church, theocracy, wars of religion. My advisor is telling me to go diplomatic service or medieval fairs. So I'll go medieval fairs. Choose some production down here. What do we got? What do we got? Nothing with gunpowder yet. Oh, no, that's not true. We have musket men. Uh, let's see. 
We can do the Mombaza. Oof. Did that say it has to be adjacent to an aqueduct? What did that say? It did not say. It just wants to place it there. Why does it want to place it there? Grassland? Plains? Why does it want to place it in... Okay, it must be construct constructed in rainforest or woods. So this is woods up here, right? Okay, so... Can I buy that? It's 95. And then choose production. And I'm going to put it right here. Yes, I do. Choose some more production. Do that there. More production. This guy. Let's go ahead and repair the harbor. And I think I want to build, purchase a builder. Yep. <clears throat> Rumor has it Greece has progressed from the modern era to the atomic era? Are you kidding? city. I'm confused. Okay, unit needs orders. I'm going to bring this guy in here. Oh, the pikeman can go straight for the knight. That's not going to be good for the pikeman, so. Uh, fortify until healed. You're going to sleep. This guy must be completed on a commercial hub. Okay, so he's going to sleep right here. And that's the next turn. For Jimmy. He must have a lot going on up there. He's probably getting that video set up for four to watch. Four to watch. So I thought I was building a settler for up here. I am. It's just gonna take three more turns. So let's look at the tech tree. Greece is in the atomic era already, right? So Renaissance, industrial, modern, atomic. Holy cow. You there? 
Jimmy. Alright, I think he stepped away for a minute. Well, how in the heck did Greece get to the Atomic Era already? That is like blowing my mind. So, earn a great profit to start a full religion. So if you look at the great people, great profit. All individuals of this type have already been earned. Oh, there's only the one great profit. I guess that makes sense. So choose civic. Um, I don't know what to go for. Military tradition, I guess, so we can catch up. Choose production down here. Our production is going to be... going to do an embaza. A water mill. Bonus resources improved by farms gain plus one food. Each city must be adjacent to a river. I guess I'll do that. And then I want to bring the trebuchet in. I really do. This trebuchet needs to fortify until healed. This trebuchet can promote now that he's moved. Jimmy says he's seen that. That is absolutely nuts. We have no chance of winning if So we've got some builders here. Um, right, we're doing the fishing boats here. So now that this guy is done, I'm going to have him go right here, because the settler is going to come up here. How do I run to the atomic era? That's going to be a lot of turns to get there. A lot of turns to get there. But I can work on boosting, right? So this is boosted. 
This is to boost. I need two universities. And then that's boosted. Kill a unit with a knight to boost that. Have two forts in your territory, both constructed by a military engineer. How am I supposed to get that? That's only four turns, it's fine. Uh, build a niter mine. So right now I need two universities. So I need one niter to upgrade that. Do I have any niter? Is that what this stuff is? It is. There's one right there. I don't have access to any niter. I'm sure that Greek does though. I don't know, I can't tell. What does what does Jimmy have? He's got gypsum, whales, nothing, nothing. Gorgo McDeal, holy, wow. No niter. China, I'm sure China's, China's gotta have it, no. Cyrus. No niter. Okay, I need to make a move on niter like yesterday. So there's the one. Can I purchase another settler? No, I can't. But I can make one in seven turns. Seven turns, really, that's too far away. Um, I mean, Honestly. I'm just going to kind of go towards... Um, what do I think? Totalitarianism. Fascism. Let's do that. Communism. You know, I like communism. Let's go for that. ships out of the way so that I can get my boats across. I purchase a builder <coughs> if I can. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, what are we doing here? Can I build the Mbaza? I sure can. Plus five all down here. Plus five is what's up. Let's do it. Production down here. I needed a... a district in order to use the great merchant, right? A specific district. I don't remember what it was. Entertainment complex, maybe? Commercial hub. Let's do... Uh, 
Hmm. Let's do a campus. Oof. We can't. We're gonna have to wait on the campus. We'll do a harbor then. Do the harbor right here. And grab this builder. And come out here and get some fish. Some more production over here. Very good, 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 good. Uh, we can do the Mbaza right there across the water. I think I will do that. Put the Carvels on alert. This settler's not sleeping, is he? I don't think so. All right, I want to move him right here, actually. Send envoy. Suzerain here is Gorgo. It's not Gorgo off of the Suzerain. It'll be me. Buenos Aires has declared war on Frederick Babosa. Did your thing there. Go up to the plantation. Do your thing at the plantation. Over here and do some repair work. Start pillaging for the gold. Tower. I guess I can start moving that in too. Skip a turn there. Bakvaku. Oh, that's the one I just did. So let's do. Mamba Lovato. Met the Australians. I met the Carthage city state. John Curtin. Hi. Nice to meet you, John Curtin. John Curtin has proposed a deal. I'm thinking he wants to send me a delegation. That is some really nice music. You see a castle under fog. You must walk there. Hey, I finished Mont Saint Michael. That's what it was. John Curtin, what's your deal? They want ivory and one gold for 30 turns. Uh, sorry, John Curtin, that's going to be a no. She's some production up here. I thought we did the Mbaza. Isn't that what this is? It is what that is. Okay. So I can do the medieval walls. 
Population of 13 or greater to build a campus. That's funny, I can build it here and I don't need the population of 13 or greater. Uh, we don't lead with the siege tower. Thank you. I'm gonna pillage. Pillage. Ranged attack, nice. Bring the pikemen in. And we can bring the siege tower up. These builders can go right here and do some repairy dewey. That is the official term, repairy dewey. Bring the horsemen up. Next turn. Who's the red? Barbarians. Germany's got barbarians in his midst. How does that happen? Doing a plantation here. Uh, let's go ahead and range attack the pikemen. Is up. Skip that turn. Chiefs production down here. We want the university. You are going to skip a turn. You can come down here and repair -o the Lando. Next turn. Fetch has a lot of units up there. What do we got? Oh, Barbosa, another deal that will be wholly inadequate. So if we look at world rankings, 514 strength. Science. John Curtin has the science victory going, which is weird because. Gorgo is said to have atomic, right? I don't quite understand that. Maybe we can go ahead and take the horses out, move the pikemen over. gonna leave I'm gonna leave that right where it's at claim great person what do we have great admiral absolutely I'll take that grants one promotion level and 50% combat experience to a military naval unit it's looking 
production. Can't do really any of that stuff. What is the Jebel Barkal? No, let's do the ancient walls. Siege tower, go to sleep. Horseman, skip turn. Builder here can, oh, hey, that's where we're going. Right. Our great admiral, come on over here. Turn on that builder next turn. Why can't he repair that? That must be a district. Barbosa Kin denounced me. Oh, that's sad. Pillage for some faith. He cannot ranged attack there. build the campus. We got some plus twos down here. There's a plus three there. I think I'll do it there. Alright, we've got a monument to repair and it looks like that's it. So we'll go ahead and repair that. These crossbowmen are not adequate for what's down here. Uh, you know, I'm really sorry you feel that way, Ken. What's your deal, Babosa? Pff, uh, not even close to good enough. Unit available for promotion. He already took his turn though, so I can't do it this turn. catapult to switch places here. I'm just going to back the horseman up for a minute. We'll do the Reparo Reparo. These guys here, this here. How come you can't range attack from there? That is like really upsetting me. Hmm, he's got a pretty good position right here. Evil wall. 
falls down there. Skip turn on the horseman. You just moved, which is why you can't attack. I'll just keep pillaging the faith, I guess. building a city here and I'll build the sawmill here Oof. there's just I need to get rid of this barbarian camp down here This has been quite the eventful game thus far. Germany might be making some ground with that knight up there in the top right. Um, but yeah, we'll uh, pick this up in the next episode. Hey guys, thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. If you stayed with me this long, hit that like button, hit that subscribe. You guys are the best, guys and gals. I hope you're having a great day. Hope you've had a great day. Catch you on the next episode. But before that, I wanna bring your attention to this slide of mine. Life is difficult, but people are always willing to listen. So if you're having a hard time, just take a few seconds, maybe a minute. All you gotta do is say, hey, um, do you have some time to talk? Um, I'm really, I'm going through some things. I really need to talk to somebody. Just reach out and know you're not alone. Know that you are important and you make a difference in the world. You have an impact on other people and that's important to remember. So until next time, I'm Shan TV. Thanks for watching. See you next time.